voice. He leaves a voicemail and he says, you need to call me back. This is Dr. Whatever. Um, and it's urgent. So this is round six, y'all. So my last video, I told you guys I was going to show you how I make my smoothies and I add the, the stuff that y'all told me to add. Some spirulina, moringa, spinach, like all this type of stuff. I put it in the smoothie, what I wanted to show y'all. So let's go to the kitchen. Disregard the hot mess of a kitchen because things are happening in here, okay? But let me just show you what I have for the smoothie. So I have the certified organic super greens powder with wheatgrass, kale, moringa, and spirulina. I think that's how you say that. So one serving of this and almond milk and strawberries and a banana. And we have this lovely ninja blender. This thing is so powerful. If you don't have a ninja blender, like what are you using? Because this, this right here, this is the answer. so good y'all the spirulina with the moringa is not too overpowering so you can still taste the strawberries the fruit in the smoothie but i'm gonna just drink this up mm. it's good y'all should try it uh, obviously strawberry banana smoothies are good but sometimes when you put the moringa in it that moringa tastes is so strong and it's like you can't even taste the fruit so i like that little mix that i have and i got that from uh i got there from a place nearby my house it's called uh what is it called burlington i don't know if everybody has that but it's called burlington but i'm sure you can find that anywhere like amazon walmart or whatever i just want to drink the rest of my smoothie and it gives me like a little boost you know <laughs> and then i can go to chemotherapy so yeah let's go do that back to the vlog i wonder if they can hear me we have a special guest in the building <laughs> why he acting like he don't want to be on camera y'all acting shy let me tell y'all what happened my doctor called me okay i'm laying in my bed at home relaxing chilling he calls me i didn't answer the phone i missed the call because my phone was on silent or something so he says he leaves a voicemail and he says you need to call me back this is doctor whatever um and it's urgent and of course if your doctor call you and leave your voicemail and tell you that it's urgent you already know your heart is gonna just drop. So my heart was like racing. I'm like, what the hell does this man want? So of course you can't call them back because they don't have a direct number to call him directly. So I'm just waiting around for him to call me. Mind you, he called me to tell me this, even though I had an appointment today already. I'm like, why couldn't he just wait till I got to the hospital for the appointment to tell me what he wanted? Oh, so I finally get to the hospital and talk to him and he, no, no, no. Actually, on the way to the hospital, he called back. And he's like, well, I just wanted you to come earlier because we need to get your blood work in so that we can make sure you can get the chemotherapy because the pharmacist is leaving at 4 o'clock. So he called me to tell me I need to come earlier when they scheduled the appointment late. It was not me. So he got me all frazzled, blood pressure high. Babe, tell him. Yep. <laughs> all of that for no reason. But here I am now. I am getting chemotherapy y'all so my counts are up my white blood cells are good my red blood cells are good so all the advice y'all gave me thank you i appreciate it because obviously something worked i don't know well maybe that week off really helped my body to recover you know so we're getting chemo i'm here in the bed with my warm blanket i didn't show y'all my outfit or anything and i have on different hair let me know what y'all think about this short hair um this uh -huh. Oh, y'all, yes. You, thank you. So smart. <laughs> and he gave me the news that the tumor is smaller, is shrank. Is it shrank or shrunk? Shrunk. Shrunk by fifty percent. <laughs> Let me get a round of applause. <laughs> what was your reaction to that? I was ecstatic. He said he was ecstatic. Y'all probably can't hear him. 
because you know he being shy or whatever. But I'm just waiting for the nurse to come hook me. Lord, <sighs> I'm waiting for the nurse to come hook me up and start this chemo. But today's gonna be one hour, so this is round six, y'all. Round six. He don't know. He don't know nothing. <laughs> but yeah, I think this is round six, y'all. So whew, almost to the finish line. But not really. <laughs> I'll check back in with y'all after the nurse hooks up the drugs. One hour later. The chemo is done. Is it done? I'm just flushing. Yeah, Yay, the chemo is done. He's just gonna flush the the line or whatever. You know. Y'all know. That didn't take long at all. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my gosh. I'm so glad it's over. They were taking my blood pressure. My blood pressure was 119 over. I can't even see that. Y'all see that. My blood pressure is good. Hey, how's it going over there? Somebody falling asleep on me. I am my good ice. So next week when I come to your chemotherapy, it'll be Taxol and Carboplatin. Is that? Yeah, Taxol and Carboplatin. So it'll be longer than an hour. And the Carboplatin is the one that makes me feel really, really sick, like nauseous and fatigue. So I'm not looking forward to taking that drug next week. But <laughs> we're going to see. Maybe my body will handle it better this this time. This will be, what, the third time that I get that one? Third time. This will be the third time that I get the carpal platen and the taxol mix. So we're going to see. Fingers crossed, y'all. Fingers crossed. We're all done. Peace out. Thank you so much again. Okay, so what are we going to do now? Oh, no, 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 wait, you cooking. Oh, no, we're gonna that stuff. I'm free as a bird. So nice outside. It's still daylight, so that's a good thing. So I don't have to come back here until next week. I'm so happy. Yeah. I wish it was like next year but you know we're not gonna talk about that i think that's gonna be the end of the vlog what do you think i think so <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching oh you know what i forgot to tell y'all i actually got a p.o box so i'm gonna put the p.o box information right here so for those of you who were asking me do you have a p.o box so when are you gonna get a p.o box i got the p.o box i got the keys in my purse right here so yeah if you want to send me something there it is once again, I'm not asking for stuff. I'm not. I'm just posting this information because people kept asking me about it. Okay? I don't want I don't want no stuff in the comments. <laughs> but until next time, y'all stay safe.